Are you in the mood for a treasure hunt? A hunt for a hyper treasure? Legend of Macaron. I don't know what this game is. This came out in April of 2020. Uh, developer's name is Rutsimitu, Rutsi which I haven't heard of before. I haven't seen any of their games before. This, this, but this game has a real Xplig look to it, doesn't it? Kind of emanates that sort of feeling. I mean, I guess we'll find out, but... The description on Steam, uh, I will quote here. A point-to-click adventure game with action scenes, movies, QTE, and scary monsters. S I got an achievement? Oh, just staying on the title screen gives me an achievement, I guess. Anyway, QTE and scary monsters slash find the truth among the multiple endings. Parentheses, it looks like this. But it's a precisely made game. End parentheses. I am in interested in the precisely made game. You're going to start a game right now. Data one. This game is controlled only with the mouse. I will click things on this screen. To use the items, first click on the item. When the cursor becomes this, this wand, click on the place I want to use. When this appears, quickly, quickly, click! Game is save automatically when there is some progress. All right, remember these instructions. I'm Norcom, a treasure hunter. I came to look for the legendary treasure Macaron that says can get huge wealth using it. It is said to be hidden deep in this ruin. Immediately, I have started to enter. Here is the entrance. The door is closed, but there must be a way to open. There is a round hole. A mysterious square cube. A mysterious green ball. Can I put the ball in the in the round hole? There we go. There we go. Put it in there. Yeah, look, animated and everything. I will take the cube with me. Uh-oh. We didn't anticipate this. I can't believe it. In the next room, a fierce beast was waiting for me. I see a door behind him. I must run! Am I gonna get QTEs? I feel like this is a QTE part. I feel like it. We did it. I've managed to escape. It seems that here is a little hall. There is someone! Wow, a visitor after a long time. I'm a crystal dog that lives around here. Many people have come here in search of treasure, but no one has come out of here alive. The road to the depth of the ruin is very dangerous, but if you go back now, you will be devoured by the beast. Another exit is only in the depth of and conclusion moving forward is the only option. I won't be able to help you so much, but I will encourage you. Let's see. There's something at the door. Key is submerged in the depth. A door. Uh, that's going back, probably. And there's this dog. It looks like a table. What's on the door? Hmm. I can. It's a kind of horse. I can. With arrow? No. I can click on that. Big illusion yellow and little underwistic red yellow blue and red. Can't solve the riddle of the door. What is drawn is someone riding a horse. Hmm. Riding. Looks like a table. Can I put this on the table? No. Okay, no, this is another door entirely. It's a fluffy, fluffy decoration. Nothing special. Something at the door. Click on the smallest O. The smallest one, huh? I mean, looks can be deceiving, but I think it's this one.
Actually, not doesn't seem like clicking on anything is doing anything. I mean, I, okay, no, it was in the word. It was in the word. It was the O in the word. A statue. Clicking on the statue is not doing anything. Seems to be... I'm not good at swimming. Don't want to get too close. Oh, no! Game over! <laughs> I died. What an unforgiving adventure. Alright, so... Didn't seem like I could click on it. We have, like, this right here. But it didn't seem like I have anything I can click on. Uh, am I able to, like, go back the way I came? Okay, no, there it was. Go back to the complete previous area. Something like Ivy and I can't pass. Can't get past these cups either. Okay, he wants me to do he wants me to do the door. Riding. He's riding a horse. You can see, you can see colors in here. All right, I guess it was just ignore the letters that are not part of the colors. I guess that's all it was. mysterious orange ball. Something at the door. Huh? Something in the box. I found a machete. Can we pass the ivy with the machete? We sure can. There is a stone slab. Who looks for the macaron? Obtain the gold powder, silver powder, and the mystical foam. The silver powder is hidden in this room. Okay. Nope, I didn't want to re return. I wanted to click on the cup, which I guess returns us. Mysterious box. It is covered, but has a mechanism to open. S. Nope, don't touch that. Don't touch the red with my mouse. Continue. They mean do not touch the red with the mouse cursor. Forgiving checkpoints, though. Very careful. There was a spear in the box. I have obtained a spear. So these fluffy decorations, we think there's nothing special, but it's the second time we've seen one of these. Right, let's return. We did see another... Oh, cutscene. When I return from that room, a big monster has appeared. I must escape and defeat him. All right, get get ready, get ready, get ready. Click. Use the spear. Enemy defeated. I got an achievement for using that spear. Well, I mean, we used the spear, but that was the only thing we found from that room. Well, we have the machete. At least we can cut this. Alright. Three doors and a number three above. Ah. One of these, huh? Hmm. Do we have any clues about this? 
Now let's go back to... No, not that. Um... Well, we never actually found the, uh, the silver powder in this room. Oh, it's up there. Something inside the wall? I can't reach! Right, okay. But we don't have, like, a ladder or anything. Maybe we will need to return. But what we actually need right now... ...are directions. Anything around on the walls, though? We need directions on how to get through that area. Looking around to see if there's anything. We have these colored dots here, but uh, do we have any clues about what the order of these would be? If you return now, the beast will devour you. To get out of here, you must go to the depth of the ruin. You must, you know, overcome any dangers. Anything else? No. No clues from him. The key is submerged in the depth, but you still have not reached the depth. Might as well try using items with things. Can I stab these things? It does not appear to be so. So there was here again. Oh, uh, maybe this is maybe this is the direction. Two on the left, two in the center, one on the right. Let's do this one. All right. Aquanite stone that allows breathing underwater. Does it say anything on this? It doesn't appear to say anything on this. And the doors are closed. All right, we can breathe underwater. And we need to go underwater. We need to enter the depths. But where is water? Breathing underwater does not hurt does not help us too much if we cannot f Oh no, there was water. We know where water is. It was the water that we drowned in earlier. Maybe, oh, did I have to use the item first? Oh no, here we go, here we go. I can breathe, like, out of the water. I must go carefully without losing the power of the stone. Don't get out of the green. Very careful now, very careful. an adventure we're on without noticing something has entered my clothes. <laughs> that, that happens to us all the time, doesn't it? I have obtained a pearl. There is a stone slab in front of the one-eyed beast. Do not anything. Just walk. Goodness. Blue stone plate? How mysterious. Uh, it seems that I can back from here. Seems you got the key to this door. Here starts the real hell. Are you ready? If you open this door, you cannot come back here. It's better to check if you have not forgotten something. Well, um, we never opened this. Roman numeral five. Was that the only one we hadn't done? No, we didn't get that one up there.
So we completed one. Well, no, there's like the statue. Do we do anything with that? Nothing's happening with that. We complete. We had. We absolutely completed this. And then there was this. We never got a ladder to go up there. Then that can only mean Is that not it? Was it another one? No, that's that's the last one. Or is it not that order? Like it was it looked like it was that but is it not that it looks like four is purple and three is blue Like the same thing as three. Okay, they're just... Yellow's not used at all. There is a stone slab. The gold powder is behind the invisible door. Knock seven times that place. Well, here's a jade orb. All right, we have yellow cube and orange ball and jade orb and the white orb. And another, well, it's, yeah, that's another white orb. But... So we need to find the invisible door and knock seven times that place. Any I don't think there is anything unless uh, maybe there's something on the wall. I did miss that one orb in the wall. But I don't see anything in this wall. But then there is this. Is there, still is this to get. We cannot reach. Can't use. Unless maybe I use items. Oh. <laughs> it was worth a try. <laughs> I thought we were doing something there. Can't use. Pearl? Can't use. What about this key? This key? Can't use that. This? 
No, I doubt it. Can't use. I like that there's a custom animation just for one specific... Oh, what about that? Oh, that's gonna be bad. There we go. Yeah, that, that did not go well for our hero. All right, well, we cannot reach. Is there anything we could use to reach? Well, we didn't get that one, but hey, let's just try the plate. One, uh, one more thing. Uh, when you leave here, go to the white pillar. We're faced with a Colossus. When I put that plate on the door, a dazzling light has enveloped the place. After that, I was in a meadow. What a strange thing that happened, but that doesn't matter now. I must run. Uh, click. Click. Oh, it's so vicious. So aggressive. Nothing can stop it! Game over. I guess I didn't click on that one in time. Ah, I think I missed that. Yeah, I missed that one. I have never seen such viciousness! What manner of devil created such a being? For I cannot believe this came from a loving god. Oh, did we lose it? The beast hunts for other prey. Oh no! Such dangers! Oh, don't click on that one! Last my gamer instincts. Click, click, click. Oh, I don't think I got that one. I did not get that one in time. Next one would have been don't click, I believe. Missed it again. 
Yeah, I feel that our hero does not quite realize that he is holding many orbs, the throwing of which would distract the beast. Click that one. Now the first beast returns. Is there any end to this hell? As the nightmare reaches conclusion, we have emerged. Although I was running for my life, I ran to the white pillar as the crystal dog told me. And it was a dangerous ruin again. But I won't stop until I get the macaron. And nothing will stop us from our quest. Looks like a table. There is a vase. There is a stone slab. From here, think carefully where to use your items. There's something at the door. Click on the smallest O's. It's not this again, is it? No. Like, there's some real tiny O's. There's, like, a real small one there. That was the, that was the tiny one. Wooden statue. The head is moving. Square hole? No, can't use the cube in that hole? Apparently not. I can try my, my orbs. The orange orb worked. There is a mysterious wall. Looks like I cannot read what it says. No, it's a doll. It's just a doll. Why did we ever get so frightened of such a thing? It's a doll. It has light blue eyes. Don't worry about it. It's fine. Wrong choice and die here, it said. Yeah, the wrong choice will die here. Okay, eyes. Smiley face. Smile. Nine. Flower? Um, neutral face. Eyes. Two. Eyeball, smiley face, flower, neutral face, smile, missing a couple of teeth, question marks. Well, we, we have we have math to deal with here. I can assume the, the faces are operations. I assume the difference between, like, this this smile and this smile. They're drawn differently, but hopefully they have the same values. Hopefully. Now, there are two eyes here, and only one eye here. Are the eyes being... Mul the two eyes, are they being multiplied with each other? Or is it just... Just two? 
Like, is that one and is that two? Yeah, I could, I was, that could also be the case. So, eyes and eyes are in these. So, I... I'm gonna assume plus smile is nine, and then flower minus eyes is two. But let's say that's probably what that is. I died. Well, in any case, it's not eyeballs are four, mouth is five, nose is six. Because I would have answered five. Well, I guess that assumes that the smiley faces are addition and subtraction. Maybe I shouldn't have assumed that. There's a round hole. Doesn't say can't use for the jade one. I already knew it was a doll, though. It was four. Well, it was on one when I entered. Do I want to change it to zero? Sure. Maybe that turns that one door off. Okay, yeah, that's not glowing anymore. But the jade orb still does not go in. And did not go in here. Okay, Jade Orb goes in there. Mysterious Wall. Hmm, another one of these. There's sticks. I have a stick. Metal ball. Can't take the flowers. Doesn't obs can't observe the door, I guess. Unless I can put the ball in the door. No. This the one we were just in? It is, yeah. So we haven't gotten to this one yet. Oh no, it's just... Well, and it's almost the same one. It's not quite the same one. Very similar. Mm -hmm. I put the stick there. Oh, I can turn these. Does that do anything with the other room? These can be turned to. But what is the reason? I 
took the rare flower. All right, I put that there. There are flowers. There are sticks. These two have to be any certain orientation. Okay, now that opened. Mysterious brown board. I have the board. Does anything happen in this room? Doesn't seem so. Maybe those aren't... Maybe that's not a door after all. Alright, so... Let's try this here. A statue of bivalve blocks the way. One way, it says. Stop. A round hole. Let's try our pearl. Can't use that. What about our metal ball? Can use that. Oh, well, this looks familiar. Mm-hmm. Blue and white. Not sure what it was doing, but uh, like it wasn't fully spelling out most of those. Blue was being spelled out completely. What I thought was indigo was being called egg. I did not see the word pink anywhere, but I did see the word ink with no P, and yellow was spelled out. So I don't I don't actually know what that I don't actually know what the puzzle was. I flicked the switch. The mouth is opened. What mouth? I mean I flicked the switch, but I don't know what the switch does. I'm back here now. I already did this one. The mysterious wall is still here. Never did anything with the with this thing here. The head is moving. I could rub objects on it. The wall is still here. Right, there was the switch. We already did that. We already did this. Well, the round hole. Did actually, no, we didn't. We didn't have anything that went to the round hole. None of our orbs worked with the round hole. Seem like 
we can click on anything here. But we did flick a switch, so maybe there's something... The description did change. Can I, like, jam my knife in there? I cannot use... I cannot use my square. Or... Oh, my pearl. Yeah, that... That makes sense. Right. Of course the pearl goes in... In the clown. Well, I don't know if we're, don't know if we're getting past that. Can I put like my cube down here. No, that's that's return to previous area. Yeah, I mean if I if I try to walk under it, it will squish. I don't know if I could interact with anything else. Unless using the switch a second time will will work. Okay, maybe it does. Maybe it does. Oh no, a fierce beast has appeared again. It's almost impossible to dodge the attacks in this hall. What should I do? I did not anticipate I-beams. I did not anticipate them. Alright, what if I just don't... Oh no, that's gonna crush me. What if I don't, um... What if I don't click on the QTE? Because it just had... It didn't say whether to click on it or not. It's just usually you would. I guess I could try not to and see if that does anything. says that you won't be able to dodge, so maybe I just don't click on it so I don't dodge. If it's impossible to dodge, then why dodge? I guess that's the solution. All right, we got past it. That was close! It seems the beast was a gentle beast. And I have met a crystal dog again. You are the first one that came here after a long time. I'm Crystal Dog. I'm taking care of this ruin. Surely you know, because at the entrance is my partner. You has finally come here. Passing this wall is the deepest place of the ruin. This wall is easy to climb, but... When you get down, there is a terrifying beast. Oh no, another one! You must move with all your care. But it's almost there. Let's go. Alright, Crystal Dog. It seems I can climb from here. I get down from the wall, a tremendous, inexplicable terror had attacked me. 
I feel like it will devour me if I make a little noise. All right, make no noise. Time for some maze action. Oh, I have to stay within that horizontal bar. My mouse skills are being put to the ultimate test. Will the nightmare ever end? Oh. Man, look at the reactions of the beast. The inhuman reactions. Gotta be a little faster. Did it. All right, I achieved the terrifying maze according to this achievement. I overcome my fear and got past that place. It seems the next room is the last. Remembering what happened so far, something should be waiting for me. Let's move forward in complete safety. There is a stone slab. You have come to the end. To obtain the macaron holds the three elements in front of the altar. And draw a pentagram in order from lower left side to top. Unfortunately, I never got uh, the, the... I never got... I didn't get them. The elements, that is. We needed the three elements, and we don't have those. What am I looking at? Another fool has come, misled by the treasure. Greedy, pathetic adventurer. You have come here to obtain the macaron, but it is a shame. That does not exist. Macaron is not real. All your effort was in vain. What a pathetic fool. But do not worry. I will save you from this despair. Do not try to resist and go to hell. Okay, we have our knife. Attack range. Uh. Okay. Fire. Click on the mouse when the fireball goes in the yellow. Okay. I can't believe the macaron was a lie. Deception the whole time. We're so furious that we were tricked. But will our fury be enough to see us through and win the day? Too 
early. early on that one. And all goes to white. Our vengeance is complete. The Macaron was a lie. I've managed to overcome the dangers and escape from that ruin. But I didn't get the Macaron. Really, was Macaron just a myth? But I can't believe that Macaron doesn't exist. credits. Well, uh, maybe it's because I didn't get the elements. I mean, there was that one, there was that one orb on the wall that I never got. I don't know, maybe if I got everything, things might have turned out better. Maybe we would have gotten the macaron. But who can say? Maybe it's better for the macaron to just remain a legend. Some legends shouldn't be found. It is the hubris of man to decide that we should be able to unearth and own the legends of the past. Maybe this is wrong. But I guess that is the end of our playthrough of Hyper Treasure, The Legend of Macaron. I, I enjoyed this. I liked it. It did have some real ex-blig energy. I, I enjoyed using the using just just for you taking a camera and recording video of this person's pets and like around the house and use those as the backgrounds and the enemies it that's that's fun that's fun and <laughs> it's fun um Hard mode has been unlocked. Challenge more difficult mysteries. Also, the portal has been unlocked. Let's go to the last room. Uh, I don't know, maybe another time, Hyper Treasure. Maybe another time, Hyper Treasure, The Legend of Macaron. Maybe that's enough adventuring for the time being. Um, 
You know, I looked on Steam. You know this developer's making a VR game? It's just, like, a game where you're hanging out with a friend. I don't know if the friend... I don't know if it's multiplayer or if the friend is AI, but you're just hanging out in a house and, like, cooking dinner. I'm like, oh, okay, I guess I'll try your VR game <laughs> when it comes out. I don't... You can see it on Steam if you look up, you know, this. if you look up Hyper Treasure and click on the developer link and look at the games they made. They do have, like, a VR game in development listed there. Um, yeah, I, I like this. It it's charming. It was charming. Which, you know, that's more than I can say for a lot of games I played. There's like a little, there's like some, like a cute charm to this one. And, uh, you know, I, I guess this is an unfair comparison. But, you know, I, I know this is not, this is not a visual novel. But something I was thinking of as I was playing this, a common complaint I have when I play a visual novel is, man, they don't draw many backgrounds, do they? They just kind of, like, go with, like, very like very similar backgrounds all the time, and they don't, like, do much to really change that up. And that's always a pet peeve of mine. And not so in Hyper Treasure. Not so. In Hyper Treasure, they filmed all around the house. All around... So many videos of in the house and outside and in the yard felt like we were going on a real adventure and getting the getting the animals involved. There's like some, you know, ins inspiration, some inspired ideas with how you want to make some backgrounds. How are you going to do it? I got this phone. I can record some video. Here we go. I thought there was a nice variety of just, you know, settings and environments and things happening. In Hyper Treasure, The Legend of Macaron. Uh... I'll, I will probably be interested to, to see if they develop as a developer. But that has been our playthrough. That has been our hour long. That's right, this was an hour tryout. We've completed... Well, we completed an ending. It's not the ending, but we completed an ending. Uh, I, that is that is correct. That this is uh, one of our one of our tryouts that we do. Um, and it's been a little while since you know, it's been a month since we've been doing these hour long tryouts. We haven't been doing them as of late uh, because you know it's been the month of horror. I, I guess that means that if we're doing this, then uh, AI generated rock should be checking in uh, as to how he felt about about this how does he feel about this um I, maybe he feels like i don't know maybe i think that maybe he might feel like something uh something like that like yeah, i think he's smiling at it i think he's smiling and, and having a good time it's not like you know it's not like this polished professional game or whatever but I think he's like has a nice happy smile uh, on his face uh, as he sees like the you know the cats and the dogs and the turtle. It was, yeah, it felt good. It was a pretty good time with Hyper Treasure, The Legend of Macaron. I think AI generated rock. Uh, I, I think he feels the same way. You know, on my understanding. You know, I started using an AI-generated rock because, you know, I'm getting with the times. The times being, everyone's getting on that AI-generated art train. But, uh, you know, it sounds like that's getting advanced. Maybe my AI-generated rocks, maybe they're getting outdated. It hasn't been that long. Maybe I need to get onto these more advanced AI generators and make more advanced rocks. Uh, I don't know. I'll see about that. I'll see about that. Maybe, maybe my rocks are getting a little bit long in the tooth. But that's been... That's been Hyper Treasure, Legend of Macaron.